Hello all. So as mentioned in the previous video, there are two main bioinformatics resources, the first is the National Center for Biotechnology Information NCBI, and the second is European Bioinformatics Institute EMBL, EBI. So let's have such a look at the two resources in more detail, the NCBI is actually funded by National Institute of Health, and initially established for all molecular biology information, is grown dramatically science the completion of human genome project. It developed and maintained a variety of databases and resources. The first databases or the main database that developed in NCBI is GenBank, and this GenBank database that databases contain an annotated collection of all publicly available in terms of access and in term of submission, so anyone able to submit any sequence data to GenBank, and anyone able to download sequence information from GenBank. As mentioned before, it is part of INSDC and this database is one of the main data that updated in regular basis approximately every month. And there are several divisions of GenBank, there are some of specialized division, and sections in GenBank, here we have expressed sequence tags or EST, is a short subsequences of a complementary DNA sequence. And another subdivision is high throughput genome sequence or HTGs, and this contains sequence from cloned based high throughput genome sequence experiment. Another subdivision is microbial genome, and we have section for whole genome shotgun sequence WGS. And we have section for transcriptome shotgun assembly sequence or TSA. So this is the main page of NCBI, and what you find is that home page is usually updated in regular basis, so it may changes over time. In the left hand pattern you will find a list of categories or resources list that available in NCBI based on logic categories like chemical assays, DNA and RNA, gene expression, literature, protein, extra. So if you click in any one of these resources, you will open up a list of all the resources that are available in a particular category. In the center panel you will find a number of different links and downloads. So if you click on submit it will talk you to the step by step submission steps, and this is when you want to publish your sequence. If you click in download, it will talk you to the download page where you can download any sequence in your computer, there are also some access and how to use NCBI resources. On the right side we have a list of popular resources that used mostly in NCBI. So what I have done is clicking in analyze tools links, and what you see is a page with number of terms. Currently I click in the genome and essentially it will give you a list of tools that are available for doing some type of analysis based on genomic sequence data. There are a 1000 genome browser which allow you to access to 10 genome data, also it is a link to BLAST which allow you to search against the database in NCBI. In the top of the panel we see all tools, tools for searching a literature. So as mentioned before there is also the learn top on the main home page and this gave a link to list of tutorials, and it is very useful if you use NCBI for the first time. What is NCBI does is number of tutorials, webinars, and courses that are presented at Institute and available right now. You also have extensive documentation for all sources. So what I have done now is have an a click in the left panel where are there is different categories, and click on the DNA and RNA category, and what you see is page with a list of tools and databases and ways of analysis and accessing DNA and RNA. So the first top is all the resources, the second top is a particular databases that store DNA and RNA information, and how to download this data, next top is the submission. So there is very interesting to keep in mind there are not only the DNA and RNA category or tools to analyze DNA and RNA data but there is numbers of different categories for different types of analysis, so I do encourage you to fetch deeply on any category and resources. So in the next video we will look at EBI in more detail.